Hi guys, it's Taylor. It's that time of the month again. We're doing a recreating Pinterest outfits video. You guys eat these videos up, so I'm just gonna keep pumping them out. I'm gonna try to do one every single month because they're really fun for me, but also helpful to you guys because I can link similar pieces from the trending photo that I'm featuring in this video. So I will have my Pinterest and the board linked down below if you guys wanna follow me. I'm constantly pinning stuff, so I highly recommend you guys go follow me over there. The last Pinterest video I did was catered more towards colder fall weather but december is quickly approaching and there is currently snow outside so all the photos i pulled are more cold weather appropriate so there's a lot of jackets and layering with the exception of a few starting off with my favorite outfit i actually thrifted this quarter zip a few days ago you guys would have seen that in my previous video so I knew I wanted to include this photo because I want to show you guys how I would style it it's so thick so it's the perfect sweater to bundle up with and layer unfortunately there's no jacket in this photo but if I was to wear one I would just throw on my long black super puff these type of sweaters are so trendy right now I've seen them on Everlane Revolve Uniqlo, pretty much every store is selling similar pieces to this, but I would honestly recommend checking out the thrift store because there were so many options very similar to this one and it was like $10 when I thrifted it compared to probably 50 or 60. So yeah, I can't link this for you guys, but I will try to link something similar. And then underneath, I'm just wearing a white Princess Polly tank top. And then I also have on these Princess Polly trousers. It's kind of hard to see in the photo what pants she's wearing. I couldn't tell if it was denim or trousers, but I think they're trousers. And then I also can't see the sneakers, but I just pair them with the shoes that I would wear this outfit with, which is my New Balance 530s, just really completing the chunky masculine dad look. I just love my baggy loose neutrals. What can I say? <laughs> I'm so freaking comfy right now. I actually always get so many questions of how to style a matching sweat set. And honestly, I don't really wear them out a lot in everyday fashion. I just wear them around my house unless I'm like running out to Starbucks or something, not really making it a fashion statement. But this is a perfect example of how I do style them, which is just under a trench coat, whether that's a leather one or just a traditional trench. I got the same New Balance 550s on. I think the dad sneakers really complete this look and make it very casual and sporty. And then the matching sweat set that I have on is from Aritzia. These are the Cozy Mega Sweatpants and the Cozy Perfect Crew Neck, I believe. I'll have the exact links, like I said. And then this trench is from Princess Polly. I actually never thought to wear this with a sweat set. I usually just wear my regular trench, but I'm really into this and I will definitely be recreating this and wearing it out in the future. I also get outfit ideas from these videos, so it's fun for me. And then I just have on this New York Yankees hat from Urban Outfitters. And I couldn't really tell if she was wearing a purse or a tote or what, so I just have on this. 437 tote. I had a few questions about this and they don't sell it. I just received it when I ordered a pair of bathing suit bottoms. Like it just came with it. I think maybe they just gift people sometimes. So I can't link it for you guys, unfortunately. But you can recreate this look with any tote. Yeah, I just think this outfit's very city cool girl and I'm really into it. This photo literally shook the internet and I swear to God made chunky scarves a trend. Like seriously, the toe pull that this photo has over all of us is insane because I know we've all recreated this outfit or we've all seen it on Pinterest so it didn't feel right to not include it in this video so she's just wearing an oversized bomber style leather jacket honestly looks exactly the same as the one that I have I just thrifted this it's men's denier in a size large I believe and I just have on my Levi dad jeans I can't see her sneakers but I just paired it with my 550s, the green one specifically, to tie in with the green in the scarf. She's the star of the show, I know. It's from Lulu's. I think it's sold out, but I found one that's almost identical on Dynamite, so I'm gonna have that one linked down below. It's like $30, so affordable. Trust me, guys, you don't need to spend $300 on the acne scarf. It's not worth it. I'm obsessed with scarves. 
I know you're obsessed with scarves, we're all obsessed with scarves, so I have a few outfits featuring them in this video because I actually wear them non-stop. They're so practical and I just love that they're trending right now. I personally hate being cold. It's my least favorite thing, so I'm always looking to be comfortable and warm. Me, scarves. <laughs> I'm kind of breaking the rules here because I tried putting on a hat with the outfit and it just didn't look good. So I'm just going to tweak it a bit and remove the hat because this is how I would wear it. I have a beige hat, but it's a different tone than the coat, so it just looked weird, whereas the photo, they were the same color, so it worked. It honestly is getting a little bit cold for this to be practical, but I think if you layer a lot under, it could work. Especially because this is a very baggy sweater so you could definitely put like two layers under this and make it warm so this trench is from garage you guys know how much I love this it's my favorite coat ever if you've been looking for a trench coat just check this one out it's everything I could have ever asked for and then this oversized striped sweater I also thrifted a few days ago you guys would have seen in my recent video it is my favorite sweater at the moment. I wear it so much because it's so flipping cute. Obviously not the same as the one in the photo, but they're very similar. They're pretty much the same colors, just the stripes are different sizes. And then I just have on leggings. Can't tell what shoe she's wearing, but if I was to wear this out, I just paired it with my 550s. The gray ones to match with the gray stripes. Outfits like these are my favorite. I wear them on repeat. You guys know me. I'm always comfy <laughs> so I find I'm always pinning variations of an outfit like this I love this outfit I feel so confident in it it is so basic but I'm obsessed with it I feel most like myself when I'm literally in men's clothes baggy clothes I I just love it sweaters a little bit different than the one she's wearing in the photo but we're just getting closest match here that's what matters I thrifted this sweater. You guys as well would have seen this in my previous video. It's my dream oversized sweater and I'm in love with it. It's from the brand Retreat. For the bag, I just have on this vintage roots bag. I feel like it kind of gave the same chunky hardware vibe as the one in the photo. So that's why I paired it with this one. And then for the denim, these are garage wide leg jeans in the color Erica Blue. And for the sneakers, I got the 550s again, the gray one, just to keep it pretty light down there. These are like my dedicated white sneaker because they are predominantly white. I know this one doesn't have a coat, which doesn't make it very practical, but this is a really good option for a base layer and you could literally pair any coat over this and it's gonna look good because it is very casual and neutral. I'm obsessed and I'm gonna wear this after I'm done filming this video. I've been waiting to recreate this outfit. I've had it pinned for a few weeks now and I finally got a gray scarf. This one is from Wilfred, so it's a little bit pricier, but it's really good quality and it will last a lifetime in my closet. It's 100% wool, so it's super warm, but I'm sure there are cheaper alternatives, so I'll try to link a few dupes in the description box. So the long black coat is from Zara last year. They still sell it though. I have it in a size large so that I can layer under and it's not super restricting. And then I just have on a basic black long sleeve, the same at Princess Polly trousers and my platform Converse. I actually like perfected this look. My whole Pinterest board right now is pretty much scarves and trench coats. I love the scarves too because you can wear them a lot of different ways. You can get a bunch of looks out of them. If I was to wear this out, I would definitely need to layer more under. I would probably need to wear a thick sweater or a hoodie or something, but you would actually be surprised at how much warmth a scarf can give you because it keeps like your core area warm. Next up, we got another base layer outfit. I think if I was to wear a jacket over this one, I would wear the leather bomber jacket that I thrifted that you guys saw a few outfits back just to tie in with the black shoes. I can't see what shoes she's wearing from the photo, but I personally would wear it with my docs just to add more of a winter touch to it. So this chunky knit from H&M a few years ago, I will try to find something similar. And then the button up underneath is a little bit different than the one she's wearing. I actually have a button up exactly like that one, but I have it tucked away with my summer stuff. 
so I just swapped it out for my winter version of that and I think it still looks really good just pulls a darker tone through it makes it more appropriate for winter and this is thrifted Tommy Hilfiger I believe it's a men's medium and then for the jeans I have my Levi dad jeans I honestly don't know if you guys can get these anymore I know they're sold out on Aritzia but they might be available somewhere else that I can link if not I apologize I will try to link something similar I believe garage has a similar pair so I will link those for you and then I just have my 8053 docks and this is just a really good way to layer and bundle up to make sure that you're warm oh and these are Bella okay but I realized this is the exact same outfit, outfit that I featured earlier just with accessories but I guess here is the warmer version of that we got the queen herself Matilda these are Bella sunglasses this is the thrifted bomber jacket you guys have seen a few times already and then I just have on this chocolate shoulder bag from JW Pay. I guess I really like this outfit because I pinned it twice without even realizing. I hate how pointy these are. Why is it like that? It actually enrages me and there's no way to fix it. This is a jacket that I also thrifted last week. It is really big on me which I kind of regret because I am wearing a huge hoodie under this and it's still really loose but maybe that's a good thing that way i can layer even under my hoodie and it would be fine this is exactly how i would wear it just make it very street style so i have on this la dodgers i don't know if that's right this la <laughs> baseball hat and then i just have on my mini uggs my lulus and this black hoodie is from garage i don't have a graphic hoodie a black graphic hoodie so I just wore this one I think it looks fine still. I love long oversized coats like this, so I will be wearing them all winter long, truly. And the Uggs, come on, I had to include them. <laughs> Finishing off with a very similar outfit to the last one, I pretty much just swapped out the jacket and the shoes. I'm wearing the same sweater and leggings as the base. I wanted to include this outfit because I wanted to share another outfit with these black boots. I've had these for a year now and I love them. I just find I don't wear them a lot. So whenever I see a photo that I like that includes the boots, I always pin it because I need more inspiration. I think I just need to start wearing them more because I think I'm afraid to ruin them. But they're from Zara last year. I don't think they're sold anymore, but I will try to have a few similar options. And then I have the same bomber jacket on very simple i love an all black outfit for the winter i think it's so chic and this as well is super easy to bundle up and make really weather appropriate okay guys those are all the outfits i'm going to be recreating in this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know your favorite outfit all the pieces that i can link will be down below but i think that's all so i love you guys and i will see you in a few days